yogis. This week we're doing back bends. Miss Shanti here in my yoga classroom. And I'm gonna teach you a couple belly down back bends to start our movement Monday. So the first one is Cobra Pose. Start on your belly. So come on to your mat, get on your belly. Legs are straight behind you. Take your hands under your shoulders. As you breathe in, lift your head and shoulders up. Squeeze your elbows in. Your legs are straight behind you. You're using your chest muscles, your spinal muscles to lift into this back bend. Take two or three breaths. And then let it go, release. Bend your knees, take your feet wide and windshield wiper your feet. Next is bow and arrow pose. So you're going to start on your belly. Take one arm, reach it forward. Hello. Bend your knee, take your hand, reach it back for your ankle. Breathe in, lift head and shoulders up. Back leg is lifted, hand is waving. Hello, look how big my hand looks, huge. Keep breathing, let it go. Bend your knees, windshield wiper. Other side. Arm extends forward, knee bends, hand reaches back for your ankle. Lift up, head, shoulders, and legs. Lifting, lifting, bow and arrow. Big breath in, lift, 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 and then let it go. <sighs> Bend your knees, windshield wiper. Next is bow pose. So both hands reach back, grab both ankles, lift head and shoulders and legs up. You can't see it, but both of my feet are lifted. Good, breathe, 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 lift, 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 and then let it go. <sighs> your knees, windshield wiper. The next back bends are on our back. So before we come onto our back, we're gonna stretch our back. I bet your back's feeling a little warm. So, or maybe a little crunchy. So take your hands to the floor under your shoulders, press to a child's pose. So you reach your hips back. Big stretch for your back muscles. Good. Now from here, I'm gonna turn the mat so you can see, but you keep your mat facing forward. I'm just gonna turn the mat so you can see these back bends that we do on our back. Take off my hoodie because once I start doing yoga, I get warm. You can always take your hoodies off if you feel warm. So our first back bend is bridge. You take your feet to the floor, hands by your sides. Do not turn your head. You should be looking straight up at the sky for this one. So I'm pressing into my feet lifting my hips up, and then from here, interlacing fingers, squeezing elbows in, and lifting my belly. Press into the back of your head and the back of your arms. Take another breath in, let your hands go, slowly let your spine come down to the mat, and then pull your knees in. One more back bend, wheel pose. Now many of you guys know this pose from standing up, but I don't recommend that we do it that way. In yoga, we always start our poses from the floor. So for wheel, hopefully I'll be able to fit into the frame. You take your feet to the floor, hands by your sides. Squeeze your elbows in, and then you lift right up into your wheel. Press into your hands and feet, head, shoulders, legs. Come up off the floor. Hi, good. Breathe, breathe, breathe. You try and hold for five breaths. To release, tuck your chin, place your head between your hands, and then lower down one vertebra at a time. Those are the little bones in your back. And again, pull your knees in. Do a twist to one side, and then the other. And then we'll come up and do forward fold pose. <clears throat> forward fold is a way to stretch out your back after doing back bends. Tend your fingers, sit tall, take a deep breath in. As you breathe out, lean forward. My knees are a little bit bent here. Breathe in, get nice and tall. Breathe out, come a little further forward. You can hold this for five breaths or as long as feels good. Eventually you might round your back and let your head drop down. Thank you for doing some yoga with me. Thank you for uh, doing your back bends and listening to your teacher. I hope you have a great rest of your day. Namaste and peace.